Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing a little before and after of my car. So my car is really dirty. It's been like a week's worth of not getting a car wash done. And we have a Quick Quack membership. So I'm going to be showing you guys like a little time lapse of me cleaning it up. It's really, really dirty because of my daughter. And she had just spilled some juice that the lid wasn't really correctly closed on it. So she spilled it. So... I know that these type of videos are really relaxing and nice to watch, so I wanted to make one of my own of them. So this is the car outside. It's not really too dirty on the outside, it's just more on the inside, but it does need a little car wash on the outside as well. As you can tell, there's like some watermarks right here, and then um, some little dust right here that you probably can't see from the sun shining on it. But it's very dusty as you can tell, a whole bunch of dust everywhere windows dirty so um yeah we want to clean it so i'm gonna start off at my house i am at my house i'm not at quick quack right now because um i have a whole bunch of stuff that i need to take out and put into my house so i'm just going to show you a little before inside so as you can tell floor is really dirty needs to be vacuumed i do have seat covers on some of them are dirty from my daughter or us just spilling stuff but these are seat covers they are not our actual seats and we've got a whole bunch of trash to pick up before we get to quick quack i like to just tidy up the car and you know be like a quick easy in easy out type of thing over there although it's not that easy because i still have a whole bunch of stuff to do so as you can tell there's a lot of stains up here as well so we're gonna get rid of all of that and clean it all up the door um it's got some trash right here in the little small empty place going on to the back which is the most uh, dirtiest i would say the dirtiest and craziest out of all is right here so we have um i used to have a seat cover on the bottom but my daughter got it really really dirty and it was full of like slime and all her toys and stuff so now i just have like a little um towel right here and then a blanket on top because the towel doesn't cover all of the seats and because it's also very thin so that's what this side looks like also the door right here i've got wipes and i've got everything that i need to make my car back clean and then this side right here Full of stuff and then on the bottom as well right here i've got a little towel too so that the bottom doesn't get dirty because she tends to throw some of her juices on the floor when she's done but this will have like a couple of um like little dots in there we've got her little sippy cup that we need to take upstairs so we have a whole bunch of work to do so first things first i am washing right now so i'm going to take her booster seat and underneath you will find a lot of stuff including money food toys trash everything so i'm gonna pick up the money and then after that we're just gonna take it all as one like this and um we will take it off dump all the trash in it in the trash and then go put it in the washing machine with the rest of the stuff that i have in there so there we have it i've got the towel and the blanket in my hand I'm gonna go down to the trash, dump all the trash off the blanket basically because the blanket was the one that was on the top. There we go. So I did clean off as most as I could. As you can tell, there's still a bunch of stuff stuck on there. But that's the washer's job now. I'm gonna put these in and hope that they come out clean or at least they smell good. And that's all that I care about. Put all of the laundry in and I'm just waiting for them to, you know, get all clean and dried up and then I'm going to pick up my daughter. But that will be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Back to the car we go. Now I am going to pick up all of the things that are on the floor of the car that I don't need. Whether it be trash or clothing, toys, whatever it is. Put it in bags and take it home. Now I have picked up all of the trash. I put it in this Capri Sun box. I usually like to use these to pick up the trash whenever we are in the car. Or I just find one that's empty in the car and I'm at Quick Quack or doing whatever. You can just stuff everything in there. Throw it in the trash instead of keeping 
Instead of like going back and forth to the trash or getting a plastic bag and wasting it on that, here's what it sh looks like now. So I've got this towel that I am going to take off and also um, throw all the little trash shots on it in the trash. I'm going to go like take all the little shit pieces and stuff and take it to the trash. The seat is all empty. Everything's empty. There's just her booster chair and the rest of her juice in there. They're just keeping the car because she is a crazy juice girl. Here we have a bag with her toys and then on the other side I have her sippy cup and another bag full of toys and clothing and stuff. Nothing here. Everything is all clear in the back. So now I'm just gonna go throw all this in the trash. I have dumped all the little crumbs and stuff in the trash off the towel. As you can tell, there are some that don't land on the towel and go onto um, the actual car. So that's when I use Quick Quack, but here is the towel. I will just place it just like that. And uh, chair also has a whole bunch of little crumbs right there. So that will also need a Quick Quack vacuum so the back is basically all done and ready for a quick back and then back to the front we go I'm gonna go see what I've got in the front to throw in the trash and what I need to take home as well so I think most of it is just going to be trash that is trash this is trash and then these are just some receipts and important paper we do have a whole bunch of ketchup and stuff in here that my daughter loves to um, eat with her fries or whatever and they usually don't give us enough so we have some and then a whole bunch of napkins because we use those a lot especially with my daughter so that's the end of um you know what i'm going to be doing at home next up i'm going to quick crack and i'll show you what i do there So I am finally done with the car wash, so I'm going to show you the after. I vacuumed it all and I got rid of all of the stains that were up there. I wiped everything and then these are all clean now. They just have some little ketchup packets. We still have the ketchup and napkins and stuff here. So that is the front and then the door is all clean. These are just some of the wipes I just have to throw away because I did um, have to pick up my daughter, so I'm at school right now. And then the back is all clean. Got all the crumbs that were stuck in there. Everything is all clean here. I changed her seat over there. Then I vacuumed down here as well. Everything's clean. Just gotta put the towel back on so that the floor doesn't get dirty. And then right here, cleaned it all from the inside. It does have a little bit of stain, but I need time to get like some sort of cleaner for that because it does not come off with just regular water. So yeah, it's all clean. And then of course the outside is all clean and shiny as well as you can tell. So yeah, that will be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and got motivated to do some cleaning and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.